Welcome everybody. Today we are going to be replacing the charging port on my Samsung S21 Ultra and also we're going to be replacing this back cover because it has new adhesive so we don't want any water issues or anything and it does have a few scuffs so we're going to go ahead and replace it also. Um, the issue that I'm having with the charging port is um, there's times where you plug it in and it says you have water in the port to disconnect the charger and it does not transfer the files from the charging port to the or from the phone to the computer so we're gonna pry it open and see if we could get that issue resolved so here I have my charger plug it in and you can see nothing happens it is not charging the phone if I flip it doesn't do anything. So there's an issue with the charging port. So let's get this resolved and see what's going on. First thing I'm going to do is heat the back up, get it nice and warm so we can take this apart. Now that we got this nice and warm, I have a little pry tool and we are going to start prying here. Now I'm not necessarily worried about causing damage. since we are going to be replacing this back glass, I mean this back piece. And there you have it. Basically, I got all the adhesive in one piece right there. That's really all that makes the foam waterproof. And as you can see, I mean, if I was more careful to take this off, if I didn't have this back piece, I would have taken more care to not damage the adhesive here. But since I'm replacing it, this is all it takes. And now we have the phone open. And right down here underneath the speaker part is your charging port. So we're gonna get a few of these things off and get to work. So let me just give you a nice up close view here. Just start disassembling some of this. All right, so I'm going to start disassembling some of these screws here.
All right, so now that we have most of these pieces loose, I'm just going to slip out the SIM card tray. Get that out. And this should be able to come out now. like that we have the old part out Let's have a close look here Let's see if we can find any any water damage or anything I don't see anything this is the new part here let's compare make sure everything is the same One thing that I see off the bat is you see how this little pin is bent. I need to fix that right now. A little bit better. But other than that, these look to be identical. So let's go ahead and just pop it back in. Very gently just press it into place. Install your screws that hold the charging port module in place. There you go, you snug it into place. And now the important thing is when we reconnect these two connections here, you need to hear a nice audible click as you're connecting these. So you kind of just align them down. And there you go, click. There you have it. They are nicely in place. All right. We will put back in this right here, which kind of just snaps on and these two connectors right there is what powers it.
go. I'm gonna put our four screws in. And then we just smooth this over top. And that's it, folks. That should be everything. So now before I put the back cover on, I'm going to power the phone on. Just so I could test. I'm just going to overlay this over top so that I don't get any dust or anything onto the camera lenses. And we'll see if our issue is fixed. All right, so the phone is starting, booting up. I have the same exact connection here. And let's give it a whirl, shall we? Look at that. We are charging. What an easy fix, ladies and gentlemen. You can see it right there. Charging, I unplug it, flip the cord. Charging instantly. Problem solved, problem fixed. I am very pleased. All right, so you saw how simple it was to replace that. Easy breezy. I don't usually work on phones, but that is super easy to do, just following a few steps. Now let's go ahead and swap this old piece for the new one, get it secured and clean off all these areas where the old residue is, because I want to have a nice clean connection. So all this, we're gonna be cleaning off, okay? All right, so I did some work off camera. Actually, I found out that I have to transfer a lot of these pieces from the old unit into the new. So like this camera unit needed to be transferred over and a bunch of little things. So I got most of this done now. I'm gonna peel off this. So I could attach this piece right here. Perfectly aligned. Beautiful. Yeah, so Samsung, one thing I want to say is your waterproof quality is probably not the greatest because, I mean, your back piece is two separate pieces that your camera module is. So it's just all waterproofed by some glue, which is not very effective, but let me keep working. All right. At this point, I am ready to put the back cover on. I have this all cleaned up. I'm going to heat up the back side of this adhesive real well, so it's getting nice and hot. I'm gonna take off these uh, lens covers and then we're gonna pop this bad boy on. All right, so now that I have it heated up, Yes, I got onto my adhesive there, which I did not like. And let me just align this perfectly. So I could just see it better. And we are just gently going to drop this in place. So 
Look at that. Look at that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply some heat. I'm just going to go around with some pressure all around the phone to make sure the adhesive is going to be perfectly secured and we're not going to have any water intrusion into this phone. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And that's it folks, that is how you replace a back cover with the lenses. These back covers are actually, they appear to be glass. Yeah, they're glass coated in like a black, black coating of some sorts. So there you go, pretty fragile. final piece of the puzzle I just want to make sure my camera lenses are all working beautiful let me turn the flash on BAM 